Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I'm gonna share with you three super quick and easy Dollar Tree pumpkins that require no sewing. For the first pumpkin, you'll be using a toilet paper roll. Yes, I said that right. And any dish rag that you have, you're gonna go ahead and fold the dish towel into thirds. And then once that is folded, you are just going to wrap the toilet paper roll with that dish. Uh, I'm going to take a white bandana from Dollar Tree. These come in a two pack and I will be using the other one momentarily. And you're just going to take your toilet paper and you're going to face it upright. And then in that center hole, you're going to just fold and tuck the bandana leaving a little bit out and that's going to be your stem. Now I just took some jute twine that I had from Walmart. You can certainly use the Dollar Tree one. I tied a knot and then I just wrapped that burlap all around, not the burlap, the twine all around that piece of bandana that was up. And then once you are done, you're just going to tuck the rest of the jute in so it has kind of that curved stem super simple and I love the shape oddly that the toilet paper gives this pumpkin. Now moving on to the next one I'm going to use this black and white buffalo check scarf from Dollar Tree. I'm just going to fold in half and cut a square. You can make this as big or small as you want. I didn't measure. I knew I wanted this to be pretty small but you're going to want to make sure that you have enough to cover the stuffing. Now I'm just using some stuffing that I had from an old pillow I don't use anymore. I'm going to place it in the center. I'm going to cover it with the scarf, making sure that it's all covered. And then I'm going to cinch it on top, tie it with one of the Dollar Tree rubber band hair elastics. I kind of like that it has that like small, squatty kind of heirloom pumpkin shape to it. So once you have it tied, just kind of move around the stuffing as needed. And now this time I am going to wrap the top of the scarf starting at the top instead of the bottom with the same jute twine. Again, mine's from Walmart. You can use the one from Dollar Tree. I just used what I had. And I'm just going to wrap that until the buffalo check is completely covered. And then I'm going to secure that jute with another rubber band elastic that I had. And this is how this pumpkin turned out. I made the stem kind of curved again and super quick and easy and I love the buffalo check. Now for the last pumpkin, I'm going to use the black bandana that came in the two pack. Take some more of that stuffing, do the same technique wrap it. I'm going to kind of cinch and twist the top, take an elastic to secure that top. And for the stem of this pumpkin, I decided to use some leftover burlap ribbon that I had. I'm going to use hot glue just to make sure that this stays on. I'm going to wrap the top of the bandana, secure it with hot glue and fold wherever the burlap needs to cover the bandana. Kind of play with it, shape it as you want. And that's it. All of these pumpkins take like minutes to make, a few bucks to make, if that, and you can really use any fabric, any type of ribbon, string that you have. You can make them any size that you want. Really, the possibilities are endless, and they're a super quick DIY to do if you just don't feel like sewing, but you just want a quick project to do. And with fall being here before you know it, yes, I know it's July, but I'm already thinking fall. I can't help it. I'm an October baby. It's just the way that I think. It's a great way to start doing some fall crafts with just a few bucks in a couple minutes. So I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope it gave you some inspiration for your home on a budget. And if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.